The following is an instructional video which explains how to assemble the multi-chair 6000 slider system. After you receive your slider, unpack the parts and lay them out. The first step is to assemble the roll-in section. Take the pair of frames that are attached. With them facing downwards, install the four offset legs with caster wheels. Note the legs with the footrest clamps are the front legs and should be on the same side as the commode slot on the cushion. All four legs have offset elbows that should be positioned at a 45 degree angle relative to the frame. There is a small stainless steel pin on each of the offset pieces that mates with the frame. Lock the legs into place by using the included T-handled Allen wrench to tighten the bolts located in the corner of the frame. Once all four legs are installed, flip the frame right side up. Next, install the four non-offset legs into the tub section frame. Position the legs so that the adjustment holes are facing outwards, allowing for easy height adjustment in the future. Again, lock the legs into place by using the included T-handle Allen wrench to tighten the bolts located in the corner of the frame. Now flip the tub section right side up next to the rolling section. Place a connector ridge between the two sections. You may need to adjust the leg heights for both sections and will want to make sure both frames are as level as possible. The factory setting is for a right to left slide from the roll-in section to the tub section. Reversing this is quite easy and explain in our supplemental multi-chair 6000 switch sliding orientation video. Next install the back rest assembly. The back rest posts fit into the rear holes on the slider seat frame. Tighten the internal back post clamps using the T-handled Allen wrench. Then fit the footrest assemblies into the footrest clamps and adjust as necessary. Finally, test the slider by releasing the slider seat latch and sliding it to the tub section. Remove the bridge, replace the bridge, release the latch and slide the seat back to the rolling section. Now the multi-chair 6000 is assembled and ready for use.